Light is a funny thing. Nothing in the universe travels faster than light. It travels in straight lines through the emptiness of space. It bounces off planets and moons and anything else that gets in the way. We see stars in the sky because they make their own light. We see planets in the sky because light from nearby stars bounces off them. The sun is the closest star to us and we get day and night because we live on a spinning planet. Our Earth spins once every 24 hours. This is one Earth day. During the day, we see the sun rising in the east until it reaches its highest point at midday, after which it sets in the west. But it's not actually the sun that's moving, it's us. Sunlight reaches the ground, bounces off the trees, buildings, cars, animals and people, allowing us to see everything. However, on a sunny day, you may have noticed you have a dark outline right behind you. Sunlight can't get through you, so you produce an opaque shadow behind you where light just can't reach. As the sun moves across the sky, shadows also move, but in the opposite direction. The tree's shadow can help us tell the time without a watch. But what about if we go to Venus? Well, on Venus, we would see the sun rising in the west and setting in the east, the opposite of what we see on Earth. Our shadows would move from east to west. This is because Venus spins in the opposite direction to Earth. We would also see that our shadows move much more slowly compared to on Earth. The sun moves much more slowly in the Venusian sky. This is because Venus doesn't spin as fast as the Earth. A day on the Earth is 24 hours long. A day on Venus is 5,832 hours long. That's a long time to wait while your shadow moves. Shall we leave our solar system for a minute and explore further? Let's land on a faraway world around a red star called Gliese 581. This world is thought to be rocky like the Earth and it may have the right temperature for liquid water. If there is water, there might be life. And if there is intelligent life, they will also be watching their shadows move during their alien day, however long it is, just like we do. 